Man, I like the thumbs staring the pot right now. Wagwan, fuck everybody. Wagwan, get into it. Do your big one. Like, what's up, girl? Fantastic. I'm sorry. I did not mean to hurt your feelings like that and make you change your profile picture, girl. It was not that deep, for real. You changed your profile picture. But let me tell you something. Even when you change your profile picture, it's still ugly because you added so much effect on your shit. Now I got to go to you off my other phone. I ain't, I ain't mean to do you like that and hurt your feelings and all that, girl, for real. Chef, did it, Chef D, did it slap you with a burger? Hey, hey, la mama. Hey, be careful with your motherfucking questions because I'm answering questions, but be careful with your motherfucking questions. Be careful with your motherfucking questions. Be careful, be careful with your motherfucking questions. For real, for saying so. For real. Shit gets very treacherous out here. For real. Be careful with your motherfucking questions, little mama. For real. Be mindful. Be mindful. Be mindful, bitch. It's a caution sign on my live before you get on it, pussy ass. So be mindful, bitch. Ain't nobody slap me with no burger. Do I look like a pussy ass so they get slapped with a burger? Tell my please don't talk to me, pussy ass. So you got on here with the bullshit. Girl, I I'm answering questions. I don't answer nobody questions that, that got a fake page, girl. I can't take y'all serious. Don't get on here and asking me no questions for no fake page, girl. You 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 not even real enough to be real with yourself. You gotta get on here and talk and honestly, girl, die. That's low. They said, who you really got a real problem with? No ho, bitch. Doesn't look like I wake up and have a problem with bitches. Bitches got a problem with me, bitch. I am the problem. I make bitches mad as soon as I come in the room. I irritate bitches' spirit. I don't beef with no bitch. A bitch beef with me. A bitch hate me. I don't think about no bitch. I don't worry about no bitch. I don't care about no bitch. A bitch worry about me. Bitch, I ain't got no problem with none of them hoes. Them hoes got a problem with me. Them hoes got issues with me. Fuck all them hoes. Next. X, and I stand on that. I would never wake up and have a problem with no bitch. Never, never. I never got a problem with no ho. Y'all hoes hate me. Y'all hoes, y'all hoes despise me. I hurt y'all hoes hard. Fuck ass. So I feel like NBA young boy. Y'all niggas hate me, huh? Pussy. Y'all niggas hate me, huh? Pussy. We. Y'all niggas hate me, huh? Pussy. They say who you who you still cool with? Let me see. They said who you still cool with from the show. Okay, so I guess the reunion coming up, and I guess everybody gotta get their shit going for the reunion. I don't know what was going on. I don't know who beef with who because I like I said when I left that show, my energy and my subscription left with it. So I felt like I don't know what's really going on. I can't really tell y'all like who really had beef or who really had something going on. Um I I, I talked to the ready from time to time, but the ready show his real side, the ready is messy as fuck for real. And it's like, me, I'm a real bitch. Like, I stand on real shit. I'm a screening. So I just, like, started to see Dorelli. Like, he is messy as fuck for real. He jumped not alive. He played, like, the innocent role. But you really got messy. You really, really messy. Um, Prince cool. Me and Mo City don't really talk like that. Mo City is cool. Like, I never really had, like, a whole real conversation with him for real because he's, like, very quiet and laid back. I don't know what the fuck going on with Raz B. Raz, I don't know. I really don't know what the fuck going on with Raz B. I'm, I'm, I don't know about him. I don't know what the fuck going on with him at all. We never had no issue, but it's just like, I just really don't know what the fuck is going on with him. Jonathan just got on here and said, everybody's scary. I had to comment under that because I know he couldn't even talk about me because he know me in real life. So I don't know who Jonathan was talking about on there. I'm not scared of nobody, not even Jonathan. Now, I would say that if me and Jonathan had to fight, I'm going to get out there in the field with Jonathan. But baby, you are big as fuck. Being scared of you is a uh, non-factor being cautious of somebody that you know got heavy ass hands and that could break my nose yeah but scared no who else y'all already know the two brothers they call themselves the brothers we call them the power Puff brothers y'all know they coming in as a team all right say he don't jump people and all that and he don't let people get into other people's stuff or other people get into it but baby that sound like that's what they coming with the reunion with their problems so i gotta be mindful of them two bitches right there you got biggie and then you got smalls both of them you got big and you got smalls. Y'all know Chef D got a problem. He talking about dropping loads and all that. Pull up that whole feds. If y'all see Chef D, he got he got his phone out. He ready to call the police. If y'all see Chef D, be mindful. He has a phone. He's calling the cops. Don't touch him. Don't speak to him. He's on that police shit. I'm not with it. I don't want nothing to do with that hoe. That hoe kind of call the police. I don't know what that hoe on. Carry on. Carry on. Got some other shit going on. I don't know what's going on with carry on. Carry on is cool. Me, me. Me and Carrion never really had no problem. I don't know what the fuck going on with him. He is 
crazy as hell too. Something is wrong with his ass. I don't know. Carry on one of them them spiritual motherfuckers that got a lot of shit going on. I don't know. What the fuck carry on got going on? Yeah, Adonis and him. That's Biggie. He Biggie and his little and his little man and smalls. You already know them hoes gonna be on their P's and Q's trying to do me in and all that. So I already gotta worry about them hoes. But yeah, like that's it. I don't really, you know, I, I had the same friend. I had the same best friend. I tell y'all my best friend is Robbie. She also my manager. I had the same best friend since I was nine years old. When my brother died, I moved in with her family in Jamaica. We already been through this. Same friend. I stand on loyalty. I'm a real screen nigga. I stand on loyalty. I've never had different friends. I don't come from that. So it's like me being around people, I don't give that energy. Like I don't just give, oh, let me go hang around a, a, a group of new bitches and feel they vibe and be friendly and dick ride. That's why I was calling me a dick rider. Like, man, I had the same friend since I was a jit. I do not switch up. I don't play like that. I don't trust bitches, and I'm loyal as fuck to who I'm loyal to, so I just stand on that. That's what it's giving, but the reunion definitely giving. I'm coming. I already told y'all I'm coming. Bitch, I'm giving the same energy y'all hoes give. I'm not giving y'all hoes nothing more, nothing less. Nothing more, nothing less. I am not mean. They said you sound mean. I am not mean. I just feel like if a pussy ass hoe want to play with me, I'm going to play with a pussy ass hoe because pussy ass hoes be feeling like they could just say some pussy ass shit and don't be expecting to get some pussy ass shit said back to them. I'm not mean. I'm a loving person. I'm caring. I'm funny. I love to have fun. I love to play a lot. And some people don't know how to take a joke. Like, you know, I like to play a lot for real. All that shit be a game to me. Like right now, I was talking shit to the girl shy. I was being funny about her gallery department shirt. I was catching her a lot. I find that funny. I don't really hold no grudge. I'm not really mad at her. She don't know me and I don't know her. I'm just bullshitting. So I'm not mean. I just think that bitch is just soft. Like, I just think bitch is just soft. Who just ramaging? Who just ramaging? Who you think people going to fight at the reunion? I mean, I don't know. Because I don't know what they had going on. Like, I don't know everybody beef. I don't know how everybody feeling about each other. Like, even the shit with, with um, Dorelli and Carry On, that just seemed a little, like, I don't know, like, weird. Man, me and R.I. shit was the liveest, man. We had that shit going. We was going blow for blow. We was really throwing them haymakers. We was throwing them blows. That hoe was pulling out my hair. We was getting that shit. We was getting bad boys going for real. We was getting that shit going for real, bitch. When I look back on that shit, we was, go we was, we was, we was on that shit for real. Do I like Stunner Girl? I don't know her. I don't like commenting on people that I've never met. Like, you get what I'm saying? I was never the, never one of them people that have an opinion about a bitch, like, that I never met. Like, you get what I'm saying? And with women, I just think that people always trying to compare women and have people have an opinion about women. I can't judge somebody if I never met them. Like, you get what I'm saying? I never really met her. I never really had a conversation with her, so I can't really say if I like her or not. You know, I don't go, I don't say, oh, I see you on TV. You know, you, you cool. Like, you know, They don't really give all that with me. She seemed cool, though. I just can't give no opinion about somebody that I really just haven't met. Like, 